We need to start the shooting of insects of ideal management. Take positions, lights, camera. Where is my chair?
Say, I work my ass off, and the company sells a few extra units. Do I get another dime or even some appreciation? No. So why bother? And here's another thing. I have eight different bosses right now. Eight. So every time I make a mistake, I have eight different people coming by to tell me about it. My real motivation is not to be asked that and the fear of losing my job. I tell them, one boss should have been enough. Tell me about it, mate. Sibyl, when you hire people, you have to trust them. You do not hire smart people to tell them what to do. I guess, I guess you are right. Why don't you show me? Okay. I'll try. Okay, okay, let's try to get in the scene. Let's try to make it right this time, okay? Take position, lights, camera. Clapper take two, office management. Action! Good morning, Milton. Good morning, sir. Sorry for being late. Ah, it's okay. The company appreciates that you are working through the weekend. That's good to know, sir. Manager Bill, Manager Bill, yeah. I'm sorry, I just saw the memo. I made a mistake with the report. Mm. We didn't send them out yet, so it's okay. For me, it's important that we are eager to correct your mistakes. Mistakes are for us to learn and improve. I will inform all managers that you are aware. That works. Thank you, sir. Lesson learned. Stop! What are you doing? It's your own! You are a manager! You have to be strict. You have to be tough, dear ladies. Should we proceed with the next scene? It's pointed. Yes, bring over, I say. I don't know what's going on today. Come on, come on. Are we ready? We don't have one thing left to lose today. Take positions. Angela, as we said, Joanna is a really problematic employee, and she has to understand that she has to be like the others. Okay, fine. Scene of management in the restaurant. It's lunch break. Action! Emily, table three and put your smile on. As always, Angela, we are always happy here. Hello, gentlemen. So can I get you something to drink? Or maybe something to nibble on? Pizza shooters, shrimp overs, or extreme fajitas? Extreme fajitas? No, just go. Oh, it sounds like a case of the Mondays. But they have work. Yes, I can't even think of still doing this job when I'm 50. Well, it sounds nice to have that kind of job security, sir. I fully agree. Come on, cheer up now. Here it is a happy place. I'm coming back with your coffee. And keep in mind that in 30 minutes, how the hour starts. I hate my job, man. I sit in front of a computer all day long and do pointless things. I hate it as much as you do. And I've been doing my job successfully for the last 15 years. So take it easy. It doesn't really matter. I have decided what I'm doing. What? I really don't like it, so I'm not going to go anymore. No one will notice anyway. So you're gonna quit? No. Just stop going. Excuse me, what's that? Oh, that's uh, my pieces of happiness. What are pieces of happiness? These are, you know, suspenders, buttons, pins, and all sorts of stuff. We are, uh, we are actually required to wear 15 pieces of happiness. Quite stupid, actually. Do you get to pick them out yourself? I don't really want to talk about my pins. Did you see her? She's even worse than I am. <laughs> yeah, but at least she's pretty. <laughs> Joanna, can I talk to you for a second? It's about the pieces of happiness. Really? I have 15 pins on Angela. I, uh... Yeah, 15. 15 is, however, the minimum. Don't you remember that? Yes, I know. I mean, do you feel nice simply doing the bare minimum? Why don't you take as an example your colleague Emily? She has 37 on. 37, not to mention her cheerful attitude towards the clients. Joanna, client comes 
here for the atmosphere and the attitude. That's what Pieces of Happiness are about. It's about fun. Okay, so you want me to wear more pins then? What I want from you, Joanna, is to express yourself. If you feel nice, simply doing the bare minimum, fair enough, go ahead and wear only 15 of those. However, notice that others decide to wear more and also get promoted at a younger age than you. Okay, Angela, I'll do as you wish. Good. Oh, by the way, tomorrow is the Hawaiian shirt day. So why don't you wear a nice Hawaiian shirt and come to work like that? Great, great, great. Take a five minute break while I stay in your position for the final day, okay? What are you doing? That scene was completely wrong. But I did what she told me. Why are you accepting this behavior? I'm going to be the first one. They are going to lay off. Just the thought of having to go to the state unemployment office and having to stand in line. And what are you afraid of? You have all the potential to change your dreams. You always said this job was temporary. I just... I just like the courage, I guess. Why don't you show me? Okay. I cry. Okay, okay. Great shoulder. Take positions. Lights. Camera. Guys, I will all set. Final take. Go. Action. Don't take me to all the pieces of happiness. Again. Well, it's rather about the lack of them. I count and I can only see 15. And 15 is the bare minimum, for God's sake. That's why I'm wearing 15, because 15 is the minimum. Well, I guess that makes you one of those people who are happy with themselves simply by doing the minimum. Let me tell you what I think, Angela. If you wanted to wear 37 pins, like your favorite pretty girl Emily over there, why don't you just simply say so? Or you want us to keep competing here over the stupid pins? What you call stupid pins is the communist policy, and nobody, nobody changes the policy. Give me a break. We are not robots here. It's not about the policy. It's me. I've been putting up with all this for a while now and forgot my dreams. And actually, I do want to express myself, but Hawaiian shirts and happy beans do not express anyone here. They just impose a fake culture. So you think you are right and our happy culture is wrong. You finally got the point. <laughs> and you know what? I don't need this job and your passive aggressive attitude anymore. My future is not here. So I quit. <laughs> so, what's wrong with you people today? It's all wrong. That's not in my street. You all don't understand management. Maybe you don't. What? What are you talking about? Managers should empower employees. Management. It's about promoting teamwork. Management is about respecting the others. Managers should be able to communicate their vision. Management is about supporting others. A good manager should be a servant and a leader. Managers should inspire the employees. Management is about motivation. A good manager thinks outside the box. Managers create a safe environment. Management is about creativity. Okay. You're all right. Now I get it. This is the idea of management.